What's up guys, Mr. Gods here, bringing you episode 2 of the Corbacraft planning phase, or the Corbatown planning phase, blah. Um, anyways, so unfortunately, I can't show you what's been going on, but we've had some work on the town. The reason I can't show you what's been going on yet is because of the stupid Mojang servers being all woobity wobble and being basically down. So that's kind of a problem. Anyways, back on topic here. Whoa, I just about threw that across the room. That's not good by accident. Obviously, I'm not just out of rage throwing stuff across my room right now. That'd be, that'd be terrible. Um, anyways, back on topic. Planning phase, episode two. We are still planning out the town, guys. So from last episode, we took out a few ideas that some players had. Um, I'll mention those here very, 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 very shortly. Hopefully, like, within, I don't know how long. Okay, so, like, now. Okay, because I had them down in a list. Um, blah, 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 where are they at? Okay, so Little Senpai suggested that we can also make some things like a modern style. Um, I don't know. What do you guys think about that? Like, the thing is, is with the modern style, Minecraft's not really modern. Like, Minecraft's a medieval game with horses and stuff, so I kind of disagree with that idea. Tell me what else you guys want, but, I mean, that might be a no-go. Um, there's another thing she added, which was, like, we can add, like, neighborhoods and pay fees for the neighborhood pool and mowing the lawn and stuff. I mean, that would be cool to have, like, a, um, system like that. I was thinking start, because that's more advanced, but I was thinking, like, maybe everyone could have, like, a mailbox. Um, you can drop stuff off in their mailbox. You can do all that cool stuff with mailboxes. Um, there could be like a public pool and then we can have like community workers like you know like that could be like a job or something that'd be pretty cool um, some other ideas she had were gas stations no on the gas stations because we have horses so i'm sorry there but library that's a definite like that that's a great idea because we would like people to like submit books and they can sell them to the public library and we can sell them in the library i think that'd be pretty cool i don't know how we could work out a system like that but it'd be cool um, coffee shop, uh, that kind of goes with like a brewery or something, I don't know. Not really, not at all, but, but whatever. Um, animal shelter, that's pretty cool for like adopting lost pets. So basically where you can buy animals at, like an animal shop. An armory, a bank, a bank, we can totally do a bank. So, okay, I like this idea. So if we did a bank, so you'd have to put your money in the bank, but if you died with that money on you, you lose that money. So that, I think that's a great idea. You can put your money in a bank or an X, your XP in a bank, that'd be awesome. Um, other things, she had a hospital. Yes, that's a doable, very doable. Um, uh, yeah, that'd be really cool, actually. But yeah, I liked a lot of those ideas. So we can use a lot of them. Um, do, 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 do. What else? What else? Yeah, cu custom texture pack. Yes, I like that. We have a guy that can actually make texture packs. Wayne Wright, he actually can make texture packs. So we're going to work on getting a custom texture pack for us. I think that'd be really cool to spice it up and stuff. And uh, we can put some like chairs and stuff like that. That'd be cool. A lot of people like like a ranking system. And so maybe we can put like some sort of ranking system in it. Like working your way up through the town, you can buy different ranks and buy different classes. Like, you know, kind of like the normal core graph, but through a town aspect, that'd be cool. Um, uh, another thing would be like like PVP, the PVP events this guy also mentioned. We, yeah, we did talk about that in the last episode. So I totally agree with that. So we're totally going to do that. Um, we'll have like competitions and PvP competitions and PvP things and non PvP. In general, the thing's gonna be non PvP, but you can go to the PvP spots. So that'd be cool, like a PvP arena and like, you know, whenever there's a PvP tournament or something. I don't know. Um, but there's a whole bunch of things, guys. Like, this is great. These are a bunch of ideas we're gonna implement. But I just wanted to update you guys with the planning phase. I think the planning phase is almost um, coming to an end, and we're almost ready to get into the building phase. Actually, it's part of the building phase has already begun, which I'm going to show you guys in the next episode. should come out sometime this week. I still haven't worked out an upload schedule. I've been putting that off because I got a new schedule for my classes this weekend, so I want to kind of see how uh, they kind of go and work in with everything. So that's why I'm delaying that a bit, but eventually there will be an upload schedule, and I promise you that, okay? Um, other than that, guys... I hope you enjoyed this video. The next one will probably be episode one, the building phase. And then the next one will be episode two, building phase. And once we finish the building phase, we'll, have, we'll go back to a secondary, like, post-planning phase. And then after the post-planning phases, we will reintroduce the Corba town to the beta testing um, or to the public, probably just straight to the public, just to see how things go. So hopefully you guys like this. If you do enjoy these videos, these little updating planning phase things, let me know because I'll do this with future things on Corbacraft because I think they're kind of fun to make. So, yeah. So comment, like, subscribe. Tell me what you think. If you have any ideas, submit them below. If we have to, we'll do another planning phase. Um, if not, we'll move on to the building phase like we planned. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys later.